What was the temperature this time last year? It was 65 degrees and we set a record on November 8 for having the latest 70 plus degree day. Yep, it's snowing, at least in some areas around Puget Sound. But don't expect it to last. By mid morning Friday, it'll be gone and replaced by rain. According to the National Weather Service and Seattle. Weather Service meteorologist Dana Felton said the cold northerly wind that arrived early Friday morning caused temperatures to drop by 10 degrees in one hour at Seattle Tacoma International Airport and brought snow to pretty much everywhere north of South Seattle. We're not expecting much in the way of accumulation since we're relatively warm, he said. The temperature at SeaTac shortly after 6 a.m. on Friday was 34 degrees. Even if it doesn't last, it's a little bit unusual to have snow this time of year, he said. Last year on this date, it was 65 degrees and we set a record on November 8 for having the latest 70 plus degree day. Felton said it's unlikely that we'll get enough snow on this round to make any snowmen, but it might be possible in some areas to pack a small, slushy snowball. Maybe. By mid morning, he said, the chances for snow will be over and that will be that. Another system, expected to arrive late Saturday night or early Sunday morning, will head inland, drawing cooler air, once again, from the north and bring what is likely to be a rain snow mix, he said. The best chance for any real snow on those days will be in the Hood Canal area where a possible 1 to 3 inches of snow are forecast, the Weather Service said. By the middle of next week, though, it will be warmer and we'll be back to our regular rain, Felton said.